New at noon, a high honor for two Fort Lauderdale police officers. Yeah, earlier this year, they risked their lives to try to save an 80-year-old man trapped inside his burning home. Now, today, they were recognized for their heroism. CBS 4's Ted Scown is live in Fort Lauderdale with more on this story. Ted? Hi, Francis and Maribel. Well, you know, we first introduced you to these two Fort Lauderdale police officers back in January. That was just days after they raced into that burning home. Well, today, they received one of the county's highest honors. It was back in January when Fort Lauderdale police officers Brian David and Taylor Hall raced to a house fire, each trying desperately to get in. They were trying to save the life of an 81-year-old man who was still inside. I'm around back trying to break in the door. That's when Officer David broke a window and both officers raced into the burning building. John McCutcheon was inside. He did not survive, but certainly not for lack of trying. <coughs> I can't breathe. These two officers exhibited extreme courage in the face of adversity. They made an attempt to rescue another human being under untenable circumstances. Both officers are honored by Broward County Commissioners. Officer David. Each receiving the Medal of Valor. Officer Hall. The Broward Medal of Valor honors those who risk their own lives to save the lives of others. They confront the unpredictable, not knowing what the outcome might be. As the medal says, quote, brave service, before itself. And just as you'd expect from someone who took heroic action, the officers tell us they were simply trying to save a life. You know, we sign up and do this and you just have that rush of, I just want to be here and I just want to make a difference. So the thought of ourselves in danger has, it has to take a back seat to that. And not only did they receive the Medal of Valor, the county mayor also declared today officially their day. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Ted Scouten, CBS 4 News.